All right, guys, I want to talk about this deck. This deck is absolutely amazing. So much fun. So actually pull three early pull three starter deck. I mean, this is probably the first cards you're going to be able to pull out from pull three stuff like the century here and the saber tooth. Obviously, some of your first cards you're going to draw. Uh, let's just run through the deck, guys, and I'll tell you exactly the best cards that you can find here. That pool is absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, in a deck like this where we kill a lot, obviously we need him. He's cheap. It's just he's so slow to be honest with you in turn five and six i just usually use all my energy so we usually never get him off so he's he's okay for now but if we can get a way to either double his power faster or get him a little bit cheaper to zero somehow then it would be broken nova is actually really insane basically what the deck wants to do is play all the cards on the right side because we are running sentry here then we want to eat all the cards by turn five so we would be eating a nova uh, we'd be eating a wolverine and a sentry uh void and then what we would do is we would gain uh, back both lanes so we would win the lane that sentry is on and then we would win the lane that we just used carnage on or deathlock now deathlock is being used instead of venom if you can draw into a venom that's absolutely broken so much better than the deathlock but that's what i'm going to use for now it's uh, basically a proxy for the venom uh, since we don't have them but yeah guys uh, i'll talk a little bit about my final option obviously the early options there's like barns i mean it's it's not a cosmos is cool idea a lot of unrevealed decks in the pool threes they do a lot of work it's a cool counter idea i have another cool counter idea which is sandman some decks they just go so heavy uh, on Wongs and stuff like that on the on final turn. Sandman can really slow them down. My last turn could be really huge with the Magneto. I mean, anyway, so I really don't care about my last turn that big. Uh, typically, also, I have Sabertooth for free. So my last turn, I get it. Sandman can really object to that. So that's why it's kind of weird in this deck. But still, obviously, pool three is just so many different cards that you need to play around. And Sandman just allows me to control these big decks a little bit better than usual, you know, instead of playing four Mjolnirs in one turn, final turn, you know what I mean? And then, yeah, Magneto School can steal you some games. The biggest power in the game, six cost, uh, better than Hulk for sure. And yeah, guys, this is the deck. I'm going to show you guys a lot of ideas. Uh, we're going to show you a lot of gameplay, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure you guys subscribe, support us, and we'll see you next time. All right, guys, let's do this. We got the Mojo World. Honestly, typically, I like to go all on the right side because Sentry sends his guys to the right side. We do have very influential uh, cards during the late game. We don't play, we don't play Carnage yet. There's Sentry. Now we can play Carnage and gain insane amount of value. My question is, do we want to play Sentry to the left? Because I think we lose this lane no matter what. I think we just gain these two lanes. I mean, unless I actually want to go after them. Which I don't think I can at this point. It yeah, I don't think I can. Yeah, I'm just going to try to take over First right and he uh, has another Mjolnir. Nice. So now I'm just screwed completely. This is the only thing I can hope to God that we hit this cosmos. Nice job, werewolf, super wolf. Okay, now we can play a bunch of cards. I could play four, three cards here, kind of guarantee winning this. Or I can just guarantee winning this. How do I do that?
I think we win 100% here. Wow, Red Guardian can't even shut me down. Yeah, I'm too strong. Oh my god, this deck is way too good. Oh my god. I should have snapped. <laughs> I should have known I'm winning. Guys, the deck is feeling absolutely insanely strong. We just keep playing everything to the right side, to be honest with you. No, okay, uh, that's good, that's good, that's good. Thank God. Okay, I thought it was gonna go with the Wolverine. This is fine. No, White Widow is here. So trashy. It's okay, we just need, we need to actually draw into a Carnage or a Deathlock right now. Nothing. This is very bad. If he plays another White Widow, I'm screwed. No, that's a cable. That's actually really good. But if he drew one of my death locks, I'm screwed now. For real, for real. Okay, I'm actually screwed because if he plays a white widow, I'm done. Hello. Do we just fill up this board here? Yeah, I think he doesn't he destroy my own unit. We are the future. Wow, he couldn't destroy it, but he filled up my board though. There's the carnage. A bit late. What is this saber tooth? Shit, we should have actually played this all here. I don't know what I, what the hell am I doing even. I think we just do this. Snap this. Because no, I think I just get stronger here. I know I can't kill Nova, but Widow's Kiss is actually now pretty strong. <laughs> and that's it. I win this and this lane, right? Yeah, then I win every lane. Okay, we win everything. Shang-Chi. Ooh, he does win this right lane. Cool, we win everything. Okay. Not bad, boys. I mean, this deck is doing a lot of work. I mean, we have... We did misplay. We should have played everything here to the right. But we also wanted to win this. I mean, Mojo World is such a lottery ticket. All right, we need to focus up here, guys. I think very winnable here. Oh, we can't play anything here on this side. Anyways, we want to play everything on this side. We don't have to play Claw. Really transform all the cards. I mean, I, I literally lose game. I literally lose game here if I don't play it. I'm just gonna have to do it. I think I get two hulks. I mean, locations really screw the whole game over, man. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I've never seen anything like this. It just changed the whole game. Usually, I want to play on the right side. Now, I'm forced to play center. This does shut this off, but... Which is nice value, honestly, there. Now, we got two of these. Gotta get rid of one. What was this? The Abbey? Okay, come on. Potentially should have played Carnage down here. But now we can play Claw. Because we auto win this lane. We actually give up this lane. on me so if he plays Odin for example I'm totally screwed here Dang. 
If he plays Odin, I think I lose this. Oof, thank God. <gasps> Shu Cheng, she was insane there. I'm not gonna. Wow. We are the future. Oh, that felt so bad. Shang-Chi hurt me so bad. 